Hello everybody, I am Dr. Rahima Daga, Surgical Oncologist from Rajiv Gandhi Cancer Center, Delhi. Today we are going to discuss the surgical management of breast lumps. We have already discussed lumps in the breast in a previous video. So what happens is, lumps are detected in the breast. They are quite awful, but please do not panic once they are detected. 80% of the breast lumps are usually benign. They do not have the dreaded cancer within it. But then it comes a big but but but. All breast lumps need to be checked by a breast expert, a surgical oncologist and then investigated to rule out if there is any cancer in it. Once ruled out, it is safe. Another interesting and very important feature of breast lump is not all lumps need to be removed. Most of them can be followed up. It's not necessary to go under the knife. Once you detect a lump, you go running to a doctor and you get the lump removed. No. Every procedure needs a thorough preparation. Like, you know, every exercise needs a warm-up. Every, every food course, it starts with an appetizer. Every procedure needs a thorough preparation. So we should have a very crystal clear picture in our minds. Once the breast lump is detected, what we need to do. The important steps. First, go to a surgical oncologist. Go to a breast expert. Get yourself clinically examined. What is the problem? Where is the lump? How it is related? What is it all about? The examination will lead to further investigations and imaging. Investigations depend upon your age. If you are less than 40, it might be an ultrasonography of the breast. If you are more than 40, it may be a mammography or a sonomammography. If the details or the characteristics are a little bit suspicious, you may be advised a further MRI of the breast. A biopsy or an SNAC may be advised after this. All this constitutes the triple assessment. The clinical examination, the investigation, the imaging. They give almost a 99.9% .9 confirmatory diagnosis of your breast lump. If it is decided upon all this, whether it is a benign or malignant. If it is a malignant, the whole procedure changes. If it is benign, then we need to decide whether that lump needs to be out or it can be followed up. So everything is a corroboration. You just can't go like you have a lump and you just, you know, you have to get it removed running to a doctor and get it removed and the thorough investigations are not done. It's just not done. You'll end up in a soup. Please don't do that. So what are the steps? First, get yourself checked. Sometimes, like, you know, the lump is clinically detected. Sometimes it's image detected. You go for a health screen, you go for an executive health checkup and you get a lump which is image detected how to proceed so the doctor you choose the setup you choose it's very important if the lump is image detected the hospital should have the facilities or the institute should have the facilities of a ultrasound guided via localization or a stereotactic localization the doctor should be well versed with the procedure of how to proceed right starting from the incision to removing the lump with good margins that is usually clinically we take a, a centimeter around or if it is benign we try to enucleate whatever it is to remove it a block and then no piecemeal removal to send it for frozen section if there is the slightest of suspicion about the diagnosis and then to wait for the report of the diagnosis as well as the margins so that like, you know, even a wee bit of doubt can be cleared right on the table. Now you might not know like, you know, what a frozen section is. 
Throws in section is that if like you have a doubtful FNAC report, you say no, ki FNAC to karai thi, usme kuch nahi aaya. Sometimes what happens, it's a false negative FNAC. So you need to know like, you know, your report is suspicious or atypia or undefined, inconclusive. Then it can be corroborated on the frozen section report with the diagnosis. And then it can be taken care of if it is suspicious. The axilla can be addressed. The incision, the reconstruction can be planned at the same time. There need not be a staged or a second surgery. Clips can be placed properly. We can design. So basically, you'll be cured. Cosmesis will be taken care of. Your disease will be cured. There will be lesser complications and there will be peace of mind. It all comes with a little bit maybe increase in cost from any other center. But then it is your life. It is you beneath the knife. You have to decide. We want the very best in our life, the best of equipments, the best of technology. But when it comes to us, like, you know, we ask discounts from the doctor. You don't need a discount for your life, right? You need to go to the right person so that you have less complications. Even though it is a very small surgery, consider to lump hi to nikana hai, lumpectomy hai. Don't take it lightly. Even lumpectomy is a surgery which needs to be done properly. Every surgery is an art and needs to be done properly. Thank you so much.